Hey guys, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII, where we have gone through and collected, as far as I'm aware, all the bits of the huge materia, and now we're kind of running around doing a few levelly up things, getting our chocobo materia up to scratch, things like that, generally seeing what we can do with all the new equipment we've got. Uh, I think Cloud's going to do a double cut, I think Sid can do a steal off of these, let's see what we get, and then maybe a morph to follow up as well. Let's just see what wonders I hear hidden inside these creatures that mm, is this going to be good enough i don't know couldn't steal anything that doesn't mean there was nothing to steal though so we're gonna have to bear that in mind cloud thankfully doesn't have the counter attack but yuffie does so she could very well end up killing stuff just just like that uh, that's no big problem because of course we are trying to get through all of yuffie's limit breaks as fast as possible because we want to level her up before we have to swap her out for a new character in here i'm uh, also thinking maybe we're going to go through the game in a little bit of a different style style normally what happens is we reach a bit of storyline and i'm like right we've got to swap out all our characters here for that particular bit of storyline what i might do is have cloud and the person i'm trying to level up and then the person whose storyline we are doing I, I think that would be a good way of doing this i'm really looking to have a chocobo fight right about now for no other reason than i would like to and then we're going to go to bergenhagen's place yes bergenhagen maybe we're going to go straight to bergenhagen uh, i would also like to find out what these guys have to steal uh, uh, maybe Yuffie could do with a little bit of a heal on the go there. I can't remember who I gave the healing magic to. I assume it is Sid, but this assumption has sometimes left me a being of wrong ever for now. All right, we got anything worth getting? Couldn't steal anything. Well, whatever, buddy. Whatever. I forgot to look at Cloud's magic to see if he had healing. You never know. Yuffie could die in this round. I've got a feeling she's not, but she, she could. She could. Uh, so let's have a look. Magic. No, oh, or we could not. Uh, Yuffie morph. Never gonna work. Never. We're literally never gonna get the morph, the morph under go. So the reason I'm not too bothered about the fact that Yuffie's been taking a lot of damage is that I'm about to do her other limit break, Clear Tranquil, and this is one that gives all the HP back to our allies. So as long as she doesn't die in the intermean, intermeaning time, no, intermittent time, uh, then we should be all good. So that means we don't even need. Uh, the the healing, the regen. Yeah, boom. Everybody, oh, that wasn't quite as powerful as I was expecting, actually, Yuffie. If you could do a little bit better next time, I would be a happy bunny. Thank you. Thank you very much. So this guy's got all 2,000 of his hit points. That's no problem, though. That's no problem. Are we going to get Cloud to do a thing? I don't know. Let's have a look. Let's, um... No, I don't think Cloud's going to do a thing, actually. We're just going to sit back and wait for Yuffie to finish this all on counter -return. Yes, yes, yes. Do I take counter-attack off her? I am looking to make it master, but at the same time, I'm also trying to get through a lot of other stuff. I, I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's go magic. Was it Sid? I think it was Sid. Cure. Bam. Give, give that girl some healing. It, it's, a it's a necessity. It really is. All right, let's go, let's go fight Bergenhagen. It turns out Chocobo fight was not on the agenda, but that's all good. So we've got Costadale Soul over there. That, well, that's... Uh, Fort Condor, but I'm appointed roughly at Costa del Sol. There's Junyun. Hey, we could have taken the submarine, I suppose, but that's fine. Well, if that's Costa del Sol, is this gold saucer? That is indeed gold saucer, which means Bergenhagen is somewhere close to here. Cosmo Canyon, here we come. Uh, there's Gongaga. I love the names in this this game. Uh, they're all so good. All so good. All right, we're going to have to land somewhere like here, but that should be fun. If only had a chocobo. We could have literally just like ridden out on a chocobo, gone on there without having any interactions with any bad guys but why would i want that of course we want the interaction with bad guys uh, i'm not sure about this actually uh steel morph death blow yeah why not crits or nothing that's the way this works crits or nothing okay what have we got there stole a potion that's that's rubbish who wants a potion no stealing more no more stealing for you uh we've got that bar up for absolutely no reason let's uh, let's do a sense and do another more it'll be good to know how much damage i can lay down before these guys just succumb to general beatings uh there we go death blow uh, defend thyself defend thyself 400 weak against cold weak against punch is punch a magic type? Is that is that actually a thing? Or are we saying they're just generally weak to being hit in the face? I don't know. Let's try and sense that guy as well. I'm going to carry on morphing. Oh, here comes the counter-attacks. It's... Uh, rip. Rip. Okay, well, that, that's fine. 
I, I'm not really trying to morph these guys for anything other than just seeing what they've got. I have missed out on quite a few items by not doing so, and indeed not stealing. Turns out the rude battle that we've just had in Rocket Town, he was carrying a particularly nice bit of armor that we could have used, and uh, it just, just didn't work for us. Oh, it was a shame. All right, let's come in here and have a look. Yo, welcome to Cosmo Canyon. Oh, it's you. It's terrible, the color of that unlucky star. The children are also scared that they won't even go outside. I'd rather not see it either. Okay, we, we, we need to swap someone out here. Am I going to swap Sid or am I going to swap Yuffie? I think I'm going to swap Sid. As much as I love Sid, and he is like one of the best guys out there, I think we're going to bring Red 13 into this for now. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. Do we want to swap Sid's armband off? I'm a little bit worried that his, um, materia here is gonna get lost. Crystal bangle, can we do any better than that? Um, can I come to this please, thank you? Something, let's give him the endercop. It's a fairly bad piece of, uh, equipment. Well, it's great if you like to use a lot of magic, but I like to balance stuff out in other ways. So, to me, it's a fairly bad bit of equipment, but it does hold all the materia, so I can use it as kind of a holding space to put Red 13 into the group here. Uh, we can then go for equipment, put the red, uh, the crystal bangle. Oh, you've got a mithril one. Uh, crystal, where, where are we? It's here somewhere. Bam, we'll put that back on. The plus beret is brilliantly set up for growth. That's what we want. What are we going to give him here? Probably poison protection. We don't want to automatically put him in berserk. Maybe we want to protect from poison, fury, and sadness. No, no, they're bad. Uh, I, I never know which one to do here. I never know which one to do. I might just give him some luck. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, we're now going to go exchange. We go, hey, where's Sid? Sid? Sid. Sid. There we go. Sid goes to red 13. There he is. It should be just a perfect job across. I, I think. I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool. So now he's got everything that Sid had. Uh, we could do with... Oh, look at that. Chocobo Law's going underway. The Ultima is definitely, definitely building up here. Titan and Shiva. Maybe we could do something about these. Shiva is getting very close to actually being leveled. Uh, 15,000 points. Not as close as re, um, Restore is. Restore? Yeah. 1397 to go. A co good couple of fights and we will be done there. Uh, okay, looking good. We're going to have to start figuring out... Oh, Steel can go up to Mug soon. We have to figure out what we can do about the materials. Which ones we want to level up and which ones we don't. One more thing to do. Hyper! Alright, let's go back inside. Because obviously this is Red 13's bit of storyline underway here, right? We need to go see Bergenhagen. I love his name. I just, I really do. Just trying to say that is the best. Do I want to save? No, of course I don't want to save. Uh, do, do, do you have stuff though? Is there anything here that, oh, excuse me, can, can I please get to the shop? Welcome, you still want more weapons? You sure are weird. I mean, it's weird. If there weren't people like you, I'd be out of business. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, whatever you say. These are looking pretty bad. Oh man. Have I not used Barrett in some time? I don't think I've used... Uh, wait, we know we've used Tiffa recently, but Barrett doesn't seem to have been used recently. Red 13 could definitely do with a little bit of an upgrade there, but of course we're not giving him his best weapon because he's got an upgrade build, uh, a growth build on the go. Pinwheel's useless, green megaphone, silver armlet. No, we're using, crystal, uh, we're using crystal ones at the moment, aren't we? Okay, so nothing to worry about there. Maybe we want to go to Medell or up north, uh, buy ourselves a bunch of just sort of background armlets, things that we can give to everyone so it'll carry enough materia to be able to swap them in and out. But we're not, like, worried about giving away the really stupidly protective stuff. Because, of course, there are nice, nice armlets out there that we need to use. Yo, everything we ever wanted for our hits. I've been selling materia for 10 years now, ever since I was 16. You're only 26. Wow, well, jeez, what have I do with my life. Welcome, it's nothing. Now please make yourselves comfortable. Okay, cool. What you got? HP plus and MP plus. Ooh, these are good. I might even buy another HP plus because, man, they're, they're useful. We we don't have Mystify. I'm going to take one of those. Well, that's one, one that's going to be put onto the uh, fast track for leveling up. Most definitely. I don't know if we're going to replace Shiva with another uh, summon or put another bit in. I don't, I don't know. Hmm, I wonder what's going to happen now. I'm going to save the world. Me and the members of Avalanche. Well, I suppose I am a member of Avalanche. Uh, like, Avalanche seems to have definitely fallen to the wayside in this in this game now. No one really seems that bothered about Avalanche, which uh, is a bit weird as we were like the premier terrorist group out there. We were the people that we dropped Plate 7. We didn't drop Plate 7, but as far as people are aware, we dropped Plate 7, yet no one seems to be bothered about catching us. We escaped from Junyun and still no one seems that bothered. No one seems that bothered. Okay, in here, is this where we want to be? Yo, Bahagenhagenhagenhagenhagenhagen. 
How's it going? You having good times? Everyone looks very purple in here. Look at Yuffie. Like, look at Yuffie. Ho, 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 ho. If you're ever in need of my wisdom, you're always welcome to come here. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, that's that's why we're here. Um, what, what to do? Have you lost your way? When that happens, we have to take a good long look at ourselves. There's always something in the deepest reaches of our hearts. Look into your heart. You know it to be true. Anyway, something buried or something forgotten. Remember it. Whatever that is, must certainly be what you are all looking for. Then we got the materia. That's why... Anyway, that's easy enough to say, but I can't remember a thing. It must be there. Look harder. Um, no, no, we, we can't do it. We need to have it. We need to have all the others here. But yeah, I'm with you, Red 13. Let me get on my phone. Yo, what's up? Dude, get here, please. I like the fact that everybody's turning up. This is good. Doesn't doesn't happen often in the game. There we go. Do you see it? What is that you are searching for? That, that's how we talk. Um, nope, not a thing. Nah, can't come up with a thing. Me either. I don't get any of this. Look at Sid's colour. He looks really, really ill. Cloud, Tiffa, Barrett, Red 13, all looking good colours. Even Bergenhagen, he's a little off shade, but he's fine. Vincent also looking good. But Sid, Cat Sith, Yuffie, they're looking pretty, pretty worse for wear, and I don't know why. Anyway, <laughs> moving on. I don't remember Ares a lot. Ah. Uh... Oh, just just get in there with a the little feels knife. Ow. But but no, not that. You haven't remembered. You haven't forgotten. That's not it. How would you say Ares was right there all along? Right by our side. She was so close, we couldn't see her. What Ares did. The words she left behind. That reminds me. I was the same, you know? I mean, Tiff. Tiff Tiff's good. Uh, as was I. Me too. She said she was only she was the only one that could stop Meteor. But Ares is gone. I mean she's not, she's in the live stream. It's impossible for us to carry on. What Ares tried to accomplish. We ain't no ancients, if that's what you mean. What? Did that girl go off to that place? What? That's it. What's it? Huh? We don't know about it. What did Ares know? Why did she face Sephiroth without running away? I see. She returned there once again. Correct? <laughs> Perhaps I'll have you take me there! Bergen Hagen. You get you you coming too, Grandpa? What? What's so surprising about that? I've never left this building, but still <laughs> Even I like to get out from time to time and see the outside world. I wonder what did it. I haven't felt like this in ages. Uh, it must be the planet calling you. The planet. It is calling you. Yeah, yeah, oh boy, the planet calling. All right, name Sid. <laughs> I'm off. I'm gonna go fly stuff. <laughs> oh, let's go! All right, simple as that. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, Bergenhagen, Hagen. I have one more thing I want to say to you. There's too many unguns there. I'm carrying around huge material. This is pretty delicate stuff, and we would like to keep it in a safe place. <laughs> oh, then we shall put it upstairs. Now, shall we be on our way? Okay, let's do that, man. I'll teach you how to work the machine. Watch carefully now. You just pull on to this. Oh, well, easy there, man. Uh, we, we're all on our own now. You're trying to get me to tug on stuff. Uh, I'm not sure I agree with this. Not sure I agree with this. <laughs> Alright, up we go. Oh, are these all mine? Oh, so this is what you call huge material? It's really rare material indeed. Yeah, we, we worked hard at it. This is rare in certain... Uh, material this rare is certain to have special consciousness enclosed within it. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Okay, well, what does this one tell us? Huge material. It's glowing strangely. Get closer. This huge material emitted quite a glow. The color is the same as the command ma Oh, wait, no, wrong voice. The color is the same as the command material. That wasn't Bergenhagen. Um, I mean, yeah, I got that. Oh, no, 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 I only walked into it. Um, leave it alone. Thanks. What about this one? Huge material. Get closer. It's emitting a gentle glow. The color is the same as the magic material. That's crazy. That is crazy. A uh, huge material. This is glowing strangely. The huge material is emitting a cold glow. It's the same as the support material. No. Is that Bahamut? Bahamut. Near yeah, Bahamut. Glows brightly. Both my... Okay, cool. That's, that's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. What's going on? I was expecting just to be told it's support material. 
We, we got swirly colors. Lights have happened. Receive Bahamut Zero Materia. All right. Gonna... Gonna get me an achievement first. You guys can't see that, I don't think, but got that, got that. Cool. Um, I'm gonna leave that alone. I wasn't expecting that. We got a new summon, guys. Whoop! Hype. I uh, see this glowing closer. Yeah. Um, this is this is the the summon material, right? Why didn't this one give us Bahamut? Like honestly, it's the same as the summon material. As I said, it's the same as the summon material. So why didn't that one glow? No, ho, ho, ho! Good. Now let's leave. We got a summon out of the support material. I don't understand. I do not. Un wow, that was quick. Straight onto the high wind. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. Smells like machinery. Oh, I love this smell. Of course, I also love the smell of nature too. Hmm, the decks up there. Then I'll be on the deck, just passing time. I feel the workings of the planet in the smell of the wind. I also feel the greatest of man's wisdom and the knowledge of the smell of this machinery. Well, bye for now. All right, Bergenhagen, have a, have a good time. What a weirdo. What a weirdo. I like him, but man, he's strange. Yo, we got no chocobos here yet. We've, that is something we really need to address at some point. Indeed, he do. So I think they were saying I've got to go to like the the city of the ancients or something. There's nothing there. Let's uh, let's go double check with Bergenhagen. Now that now that we've done a thing, I'm sure he's bound to have another thing to say here. Lo, I wonder where you are taking me. You you told us where to. Go. Oh my gosh, he's he's really strange, isn't he? fairly sure you told us where to go anyway right i think it's time that we went and got ourselves a few fights <gasps> how would you even know you don't know how tough it is getting sick on boats and rides so please just leave me alone um i really don't understand your feet when i get sick on a flight it's a real killer when i was in soldier i completely forgot about my motion sickness oh isn't there any way to prevent this yeah um, well according to my research First off, you're ner if you're nervous a lot, you won't get sick. But you can't always be nervous. With this much space, your best bet is to move around while you're riding. It also might be a good idea to stretch sometimes, too. But in Soldier, we spent a lot of time in trucks. That sucked. That's, uh, that's a thing. Shaky head. And there's one thing you mustn't do when riding. And that is... Read. I like reading. Once you get sick, there's nothing anyone can do. I know it's tough. But you just gotta hang in there, kiddo. So you're a little bit better off than me, but I don't feel well. <laughs> yeah, all right. Just make sure you throw up down underneath the place we walk rather than on the bits we walk on. I mean, that would be pretty bad. I've not spoken to these guys in a while. Hey, sorry, we're in the middle of a very delicate operation. All right. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Ooh. Uh -huh. I'm just going to not talk to him anymore. Hi. Uh, I told Ari's mum about her death. Uh, Elmira was uh, was crying herself silly. So did little Marnie. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, I keep forgetting this guy's actually in Midgar, right? That, that's a thing. Uh, what's Red Thirteen gonna tell us here? Ares used to pat me on the nose sometimes. I used to hate being treated like a child like that, but I also like the attention. I want to apologise to her for what I did when we first met. I mean, I think she knows. I think she knows. City of the Ancients. The Ancients. In time, that this is probably what what later generations will call us. Ha 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 ha. It's only a matter of time. I mean, it's true. It is only a matter of time. All right, let's fly. Let's go. All right. Where are we going to go? Where are we going to go? Where are we going to go? We're going to go north. Of course, that's where we're going to go. We could go back to Rocket Town, have a few fights around there. We could go to the Gold Saucer at some point and do some stuff there. But I think going to the City of Ancients, maybe even Bone, 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 Bone Village, that's the word I'm looking for, and go have a little bit of a fight there might be a plan. I believe the City of Ancients is actually behind Bone Village. Is it? Is it back here? Was it that one? Or was it this one over here? I don't know. I cannot remember. It was when we went through everywhere. We then came back here, went to the cliff yeah city of ancients is before all of this okay let, let's go and land by bone village yo what's up no not here yo what's up is this where we want to be can i see the thing that i want yes yes we can see the thing now there are there are things around here that we need to fight uh one of them is ridiculously hard oh do we do we give her a conformer i think now is the time we're not going to have any growth on our materia but i really want to morph that big 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 uh dragon thing here into a knot because it's going to be very important one day very important one day i believe it's got quite a lot to do with chocobo breeding please be the big guy no these guys all right we're just going to attack 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 that that should go over pretty quick 
No, no uh, oh, Yuffie, Yuffie's getting the limits. That's, that's fine. Wow, that was quick. And that was also quick. No, just a single hit. All right, cool. If we could do a few of those pretty quickly, we should be okay. I can't remember what the name of the creature is that I'm looking for, but it's, um, you, you guys remember, right? Took us nearly an entire episode to beat it down last time. And we've pretty much hit the end of the episode here. So if it doesn't happen in this one, I'm afraid we're going to have to call it here. All right, come on, fight me, fight me, fight me. Where do we get the enemy lore material from? It's it's from somewhere and I cannot remember. Oh, they got got for, blah, 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 got us from behind, but that's okay. Uh, what about um, a morph? Let's just morph. Do we have an enemy skill? We do. It's not quite what I'm after, so let's just defend. Wow, those counter attacks, they're pretty powerful. Hey, money! Do we get the money? Is it our money? Money, money? No, no money. Okay, that's a bit of a shame. Bit of a shame. Uh, morph? Let's have a morph. Yeah, yep. That wasn't a morph. That did not feel like a morph at all. And with that, I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time where we're going to continue having a few fights out here. And after a little bit of that, we're going to go back to Bone Village and try and do the City of Ancients. But I will see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!